welcome back to my channel thank you so much for joining me again today but if you're new my name is sam and i do normally all things disney however today i have got a christmas next haul as most of you know if you are a regular on my channel that i love next decor clothing and all of that so yes i just thought it'd be a really good idea to do this video for you today i did one of these videos for i think it was october so for halloween i got lots and lots of decor bits from next so go and check them out if you haven't already i have got lots and lots to share with you what came out for autumn so autumnal things all the decor halloween pumpkins and all of that so make sure you go and check that one out after this video so everyone can you actually believe that we are in november i have already got my tree up and all the decor bits out because i just couldn't wait this year i don't normally do it till the end of november i just thought why not i want to do a few uh, content videos for you next to the tree so why not get it all out and celebrate a little early this year so let's start waffling on and let's get to this quite big next haul so bear with me everyone also before i do actually get into the haul i am actually doing my primark shot with me which is going to be coming on my channel um in the next couple of days i think it's going to be i might put it up a little earlier than next week just because i know a lot of people really really wait for that content to come out so yes that's going to be coming on my channel i'm going to be sharing with you what primark has for christmas and for november and i do do it every single month for you if you are new here and you don't know so everyone the first one i wanted to share with you i fell in love with this and you know what i'm like with bathroom decor bits i got the halloween pumpkin one uh, for autumn and i had to get the christmas one so this is what i actually got so it's a nice big bath mat and it's got the red car with the tree as you can see it's really nice fluffy really good quality i do love a really thick bath mat let me know in the comments if you're the same as me there's nothing quite like having fresh um brand new bath mats you just put your little tutsis on when you come out of the bath or the shower love it especially if it's cold outside it just gives you a little bit of luxury in your life so yes that's the first thing i got i will put prices in the corner just here uh, so i don't get it wrong basically because my memory is like a sieve following on with the bathroom decor slashed towels bath mats so this is the next thing i got if you've got the bath mat you have to get the matching hand towel that's what i'm going with anyway i did only get the hand towel the reason being is because I didn't want to get big um, like shower towels, you know, the big ones, what you use if you're going to the bath or the shower, purely because this is more of a seasonal decor kind of items. So I just thought I'd get a couple of the hand towels just so they can be used through this period and then put away for next year. I'm not the one where I'll keep it out all year round. It will go into my Christmas decor bathroom box. So yes, as you can see, you have got the car with the trees again, and it's in like a creamy kind of colour. Um, and then on the other side, it is actually a contrasting colour um, of the green with the white trees. The only thing I really don't like is, and they did it with the um, autumn pumpkin one I shared with you. If you can't remember, you'll understand once you get onto that video after this. Um, but they've got like a red strip coming right down of the towels. I don't know why they do that. Let me know in the comments if you know why. It just baffles me because it's not on the other side. It's literally, it's like it was a 
printing kind of error i'm not sure uh, but when you do go online they are actually displayed with the the uh, red strip so yes i'm a bit confused about that why do they have the red strips um but either way it is really really nice little decor bit for the bathroom so the next one i wanted to share with you and i couldn't resist when i saw this it was one of those where i've already got lots and lots of pillows and kind of things for the sofa but i just had to get this this is three gonks with a very very long beard as you can see how cute is that it's really really soft and i mean if you want to get cozy for christmas this is the cushion you are wanting so as you can see the hats are all slightly different they are embroidery on and then you've got a little pom-pom for the nose and then on the other side is just plain fluffy green it's like a really mint kind of green um pastely mint kind of green it is it's really really nice and if you are a regular you will know i love green green is my favorite color so yes that is the next thing i got so the next thing i got is actually just behind me and it is the blanket obviously to match the cushion so this is the blanket in itself as you can see it's really really long it's really really big as well and it's super thick on the other side you have got this really soft teddy bear uh, material and then you've got the green with the stars and the gonks just there on the other side and you also got the trees to follow on with the whole effect and as you probably won't be able to get a grasp of but it is really really thick and it covers the whole sofa of mine so this is a three seat sofa I'm sat on and it goes the full length of the back of it to give you an idea the full measurements are obviously on next themselves i will put a link below for it if you are interested uh, all of these items are not sponsored my links are not affiliated links or anything like that so you can take that as a gospel that this is my true opinions of things just in case you are wanting to get them yourself but i just thought the cushion oh that's it i just thought with the cushion and with this how cozy is that for christmas this year it just ties in everything together especially when you've got your tree you have got your nice cozy jumpers on slippers on you want a nice blanket don't you so yes that i've used a few times throughout a uh, past couple of weeks because it has got really really chilly in the uk at the moment so it's just been really, really nice just to have that extra blanket over my legs. Absolutely love it. Yet again, I have been putting the prices just in the corner there so you can know what prices they are. Okay, everyone. So now I've just popped that back on, back on the back. Now I've got something what was a little bit of a, how can I put it? Compulsory purchase. That's all I'm going to say. I have no use for this. It's super big and that my excuse is that it's just really decory, Christmassy and I have no self-control. They, they are going to be my reasons why I made this purchase. However, it, it's amazing. So I hope you agree. So the next thing I'm wanting to share with you is this candy cane just here. Now this is a door draft distract, door draft. I want to say distraction, but it's not, is it? It's one of those where it stops the draft from coming in from underneath your door. My mum, back in the 80s, because I'm an 80s child, 90s kind of um, inspo, this is basically where my mum always used to have one of these at the bottom of our uh, door. Because back in the day, we just had 
wooden doors and just a little bit of like a brush thing underneath if you can remember them let me know in the comments uh, but it used to leave a lot of draft still coming in from underneath the door so we always had one of these and my kind of excuse as well is that if I had one as a child I want to keep that tradition going for my children and I brought one now my doors are new doors and they don't make they don't, I don't know draft in any of the doors but um well you know it has to happen this was 22 pounds and I brought this the other day and I have really no explanation of this or it's just it's massive isn't it I just want to put this on my wall and have a decor bit or just put it at the back of my sofa just just make it look pretty for everything so yes let me know in the comments is this a compulsory buy is it a wise buy would you do the same let me know your thoughts and feelings of this because um it's staying with me and it's staying for a very very long time i saw this actually in next the other day um and it was just hooked up on one of the little hook things what they normally put coats on and I saw it and I thought, oh, that is amazing. And ever since I've seen it, I have had it in like at the back of my head, like, oh, I really love that. And then I was on Next website the other day and I seen it and I just thought, but also what even made it more eager for me is that it was it was out of stock. So I had it on my kind of like wish list um, and like an email when it comes available. Um, and then one day I was just looking again on Next website and um, it was there. So, and it was a couple of day delay uh, because they must have had to get it in stock or something. Um, but yeah, yeah, I know it's a compulsory buy. I have no excuses for it, but um, it had to happen. Okay, everyone. So I'm on my last decor bit now and it's something where, one minute, I just need to try and grab it where it, i really really liked this it's just a little ornament and it says family on it as you can see just there it says family and i just thought this would be really nice on my fireplace with all of my other christmasy ornaments and it'd be just something where i'll make sure i bring it out every year and i just thought christmas is all about family and i just thought it's a really nice little decor christmas ornament um i think this was around about 15 pounds i will put it just below if i'm wrong um but yes it's very very weighty as well so it's very nice quality but yes i just thought that'd be really really nice so yes and it's all themed in like the gingerbread um like the gingerbread man for the y and then you've got the house but yes, I really, really do like it. Okay, everyone, that is all of the decor bits. Now I've got a few little clothing bits. I brought myself a coat and I've also got the children a few bits as well. So yes, let's get started. So the first things I got, I'm taking them out of the wrapping at the moment. Um, I've only got one to show you because I have got twins. Um, um, however, I've only just brought one downstairs to show you. So this is what I got. So it's a pajama set and it's in kind of the gingerbread theme again, as you can see. It was, how much were you? It doesn't say, I'll put it down below anyway. And then they are the bottoms and the zhuzhin at the, bo at the bottom as well. And I just thought they'd be really good for Christmas day. Um, they don't normally have new pyjamas for Christmas, but I just thought this year let's make an exception because I'm doing this year a little bit different to my normal years anyway. Every year for the past, I want to say 15 years, I have done Christmas dinner at home um, and that's how tradition has been. Uh, we've always done a Christmas kind of like Sunday lunch style at home and I've always cooked it it's always been something i've done uh however this year um we are actually going out christmas day for a di uh, for a meal basically for uh 
like a Sunday lunch. We are going to my local uh, restaurant and we are going to be doing things a little bit different this year because last year, Christmas Day, I've got to admit, I didn't really enjoy my Christmas dinner um, because when you've been cooking it all day, I find it really, really hard to then enjoy it with everybody. I just, my mind's everywhere. So this year, I'm doing things different. I'm spicing them up a bit and we're going to be doing presents in the morning and then we're going out for Christmas dinner. Um, a chance to put my makeup on, uh, my favourite outfit on and all of that just to make it a little bit special that day um, so yes I just thought this year I'm doing things a little bit different so I'm going to buy pyjamas for the girls as well just little things just to I don't know make my Christmas day a little bit more nicer I suppose okay so the next things I got is not particularly Christmas however it is in the um it is in the next haul and they are super cosy and we are in the winter months now so we all need a bit of coziness in our life. Talking about coziness, um, I am going to be doing a video after this one actually where I'm getting cosy for Christmas and I've got so much to share with you. Uh, what I have brought to get cosy basically. There is slippers, jumpers and just everything like that just to really kind of like absorb the winter months and just enjoy it with some nice cosy bits. So this is what I'm wanting to share with you and it is a hoodie. So as you can see just here you've got the hoodie just here and the alarms these are for my girls if I've not mentioned it and then a nice um fluffy material you've got your zip just there in the brown and then they've also got the leggings to go with it as well I just thought when it comes to the girls this year I've always struggled to find good winter outfits what would really keep them warm um something they can lounge about in at home but also if we do pop out somewhere really quick they've got some a nice hoodie or something keep them warm they haven't got to come put layers and layers and layers on apart from their coat so i just thought these would be really good I did get them in a purple one as well. I'll put a picture here if I can find it. And they're very similar to this, where you've got the kind of like hoodie and they've got pockets as well. Because my kids are always got something to carry. I don't know if your kids are the same, if you've got them, they've always got something. So yes, that is what I got them as well uh, in this um, next haul. And very, very quickly, I won't get them out the bag because it would just take too long. And I think I'm already like 20 minutes in this video. So I bet a lot of you have just clicked off me because <laughs> I'm jabbering on too much. But yes, I've got a set of four t-shirts, long sleeve t-shirts for the girls. Ready for, a lot thicker as well. They are thick ones for the winter months yet again. And keeping with that, I also got some more leggings here, set of four yet again. You get all different colours and they're nice, thick for the winter months yet again for the girls. Okay, everyone, that is everything I've got to actually share with you today. I've well, actually, I thoroughly enjoyed um, doing things a little bit different. Um, I really wanted to do a Christmas next haul um in front of a christmas tree getting a little bit cozy nice jumpers on and i just wanted to share that with you i appreciate my channel is all about disney so if you are one of my disney lovers i hope you enjoyed this today it may not be your cup of tea uh, however i really really wanted to share it with you today so yes i hope you enjoyed it so everyone i'm gonna eventually stop waffling on because i've now done i've done actually quite a lot of wash, waffling on in this video i do apologize uh, but i do hope you enjoyed it and you liked everything i've shared with you today 
So everyone, thank you so much for getting this far into the video. If you did, remember to subscribe if you haven't already because I've got lots more Christmas content, hauls, and so much more all the way up to the Christmas day it is. So I hope you will consider joining my channel if you haven't already. Also, if you've not checked me out yet, please head over to my Instagram, which is Sans Disney Life, and I share with you all of my upcoming content. You get the latest what's going off and everything. So go and check me out over there if you haven't already. So everyone, thank you so much for watching today and I will see you in my next one, guys. Bye.